Venezuela because inside this fundraiser here are fascists such as Joe Arpaio, uh, uh, this, this person that's running against Maxine Waters who they're fundraising for, and we're out here to say no in the name of humanity. We refuse to accept the fascist America. You know, these, these, these people have direct connections uh, to the Trump-Pence regime, and we're out here uh, to say no. And that November 4th it begins, that Trump and Pence must go. And on November 4th, people are going to take to the streets day after day, night after night, in cities and towns across the country, in the spirit of nonviolent civil disobedience, refusing to leave until the Trump-Pence regime is driven from power. And we're out here doing this because it is necessary. Because what this regime is unleashing on immigrants, on women and LGBT, on black and Latino people, now is the time to drive out this regime. Now is the time not to put order above justice, but to put justice above order. One thing I do want to say is that what we need is democratically minded people to join us in the streets November 4th and day after day after that. We are here to unite all who can be united, no matter what background or perspective you come from. All those who hope for a better future. The only way that that is going to happen is if we stop this fascist regime. If we stop this regime that's threatening millions of lives with nuclear holocaust. That is going to be the only way that we can get to an to a actual better future. And 2018 is too late.